fascinated with biology because biology produces very beautiful structures, um, but under normal ambient conditions, under room temperature and pressure. And I thought that was really cool. Uh, the research that we do involves bio-inspiration, and bio-inspiration uh, is exactly as it sounds. You are inspired by biology. So for example, I brought an abalone shell here. What we do in our laboratory is we understand how this shell actually forms. We study it and its, it's, it's architecture and its, its actual process to make the material that it makes, the calcium carbonate. And based on that process, we use similar processes um, to make other materials. And so what we do is we understand what that organic is and then we translate that to make um, engineering materials. And so the idea is when we're growing a crystal, we use organic components that have specific chemistries. And those, the chemistry within the organic actually helps to control the size of crystals that we're making and also their shapes. Really our goal here is to try and make these engineering materials that are traditionally made at a thousand degrees centigrade, bring that all the way down to maybe 70 degrees centigrade. Much more cost efficient and of course environmentally friendly. And so that's part of why we do what we do.